How to add reaction rules with Zyrobot Discord. Hi everyone, welcome back. This is a video tutorial on how to add reaction rules with Zyrobot Discord. To get things started, let's go to Discord. And the very first thing we have to do is make sure that the developer mode on Discord is turned on. So let's go to our profile settings. Tap on this profile icon at the bottom right corner of the page. Scroll down and go to app settings. Under app settings, tap advanced and tap developer mode. So once it's on, the next thing you have to do is make sure that you have roles that you can assign. So I'm going to tap on this discord icon at the bottom left corner of the page. I'm going to tap on the server name that where I'd like it to be set up. I'm going to tap on this and you should see this come up. Tap settings, tap roles, and then you can create roles right here. I already have this one role added. It's called black, but I can add another one or you can add another one by tapping on this plus icon at the right top corner and just simply select or type a name for this. Uh, you can even select a role color. So I'm just going to select pink for this as well. Tap save and then tap create. And just make sure that all the roles you will create um, are just members. As if it is a moderator or anything else higher than that, it's not going to work. And you can just skip this step. And you can add members to this if you want or you can also skip this step and just do that later. Now I'm going to go to server settings. Tap on the server settings there, close this page, and we're going to have to create a channel now. So tap on this uh, plus icon next to text channels, and then tap or just type roles. Make sure that this is a private channel, tap next, and then just add all the members or roles you want to be included in this channel. I'm going to tap create. And then we're going to make another channel. So tap on the plus icon there. And then this one is going to be for the bot setup. Make sure that this is a private channel as well. Just follow the same steps we did earlier. And just tap create. Now that we have our channels, let's uh, connect Zyra to this server. So let's go to Safari and go to the Zyra bot website or zyra.gg or you can also look up zyra.bot and you should reach this page. Just tap on add to server and just wait for it to load and just select the correct server where you'd like it to be added. Tap continue, tap authorize and just complete captcha and just wait for the confirmation it's done. You can now go back to Discord, and on Discord, all we have to do is go to our channels. Let's start with roles, and just tap on roles at the top, go to settings, and tap on channel permissions. Look for Zyra right here. If you don't see Zyra just yet, uh, just add a role and select Zyra. Now, make sure that Zyra has the permission to view channel and to also send messages. So just tap on this check mark next to each permissions and tap done at the right top corner of the page. Now, when you go back here, you can see that Zyra is already here. And let's go back to our channels page and also do the same for bot setup. So settings and channel permissions let's add zyra first and just make sure we give zyra the same permissions on this channel as well now let's go back but as you can see in our rules zyra is at the bottom of black and pink so we're gonna have to change that as well in order for it to work we're gonna have to go back to uh, to the server settings uh, let's go to roles and just reorder our rules. So we have to make sure that Zyra is at the top of everyone else or everything else here and just tap save. 
Now that Zyra is at the top of all of the other rows, let's go back to our text channels and begin with rows. So just long press rows and just tap on copy channel ID. Now we're going to have to go to bot setup. And on bot setup, just simply type or yeah, type a slash and then type channel and simply paste that channel ID you copied earlier and send that. You should get this confirmation from Zyra. And the next thing you have to do is type another slash, type message. Let's do that again. Message send. And let's set up the message we want the new members to get. So I'm probably just going to say react to get rules and just send this. All right, so our message is set. Next step is to do another slash and tap add. Now we're going to have to tap normal here. And for emoji, let's select any black emoji here. Maybe just this black heart. And for the role, we're going to have to um, select black or whatever role you'd like the emoji uh, to have. So I'm going to tap on send. And as you can see, we've set that up. Now I'm going to show you how it works. I'm going to go back to roles. And as you can see, we have here the black icon already. If you're going to take a look at the members, I currently don't have any role. Um, on this channel and if I tap on the emoji I set up for the black roll as you can see my um, or this channel automatically gave me the roll black so you can do the same thing you can just add more roles here just go to bot setup and do the same process add and then just put normal and then put um, the emoji you'd like to use for this. And then the role, pink. Just send that. Go back to the roles um, channel. And as you can see, we have added the emoji right here. And that's how easy it is to add reaction roles with Zyrobot Discord. If you found this video helpful, feel free to let us know in the comments below. Like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.